Hi, I'm Evan Pantazzi. A while back, I did an article for Black Belt Magazine and followed up with a uh, videotape on it. And this was back in the 1990s, early 2000s. I think it was late 1998, uh, 99, something like that. Anyway, uh, it was called Anatomy of a Hook Punch. And it was a, um, a great seller at the time. There was uh, nobody doing boxing with uh, the Q Show. And uh, showing why the Q show would work in a ring and how it would work and the little inflections you had to do with your punching. Now, this works on a heavy bag as well as a human. And there are many targets on the body that you can utilize the, uh, the hooking punch. Now, what I'm describing as a hooking punch isn't just the classic swing, although that's involved as well. The hook is the dropping of the fists. Now, when you're doing this into the body, it takes a little bit more um, practice or training because what's gonna happen is you're gonna hit a heavier mass than just the head. Now, this still works uh, in, with the gloves, uh, even the big 16-ounce uh, gloves. So when you're dropping the, these punches, you're gonna be needing that hooking action of the hand. Now, if you've watched my 6G uh, hands film or many of the excerpts here on uh, YouTube, you'll see that the, um, the wrist is a, a great enactor for Q-Show. And the reason is the transference of kinetic energy. Now, when you just bang a person in the head with a hooking punch, what's gonna happen is the head turns to the side or moves to the side, neck muscles absorb a little bit of the shock, the body muscles, of course, the head takes the brunt, but as it moves away, it absorbs a lot of that power. And sometimes if they're hooked just right, they're going down anyway because the head rapidly turns and it activates the brain stem. Well, if you're not gonna activate the brain stem because you've got like a jab, uh, you're going to need a hooking action with the, um, the hand. Now, this is um, working against different nerves of the head. And what we're gonna do in the extended video is we're gonna be working with these um, uh, targets and I'll explain them. I'll show you them anatomically in renderings and also um, work with some uh, tapping in the dojo too so you can see the effects of just light taps and they are with gloves so you will see the, um, the actions and the ramifications with just very light pressure because again we were just training and we were training for um, two solid hours. You can't get um, knocked uh, unconscious or down for two hours and keep going, okay? So it, we, we paced it a little bit, and we kept it a little easier on each other, but we're working with boxing drills. Now, several different strikes that we're gonna be accomplishing in this video here is going to be on the head. There's many different targets. The original number of targets on the original film was eight, and we had those listed out. Now we're gonna go over those same eight, put in a couple more, and then uh, the next segment, uh, the following week, or the following Friday, will be for um, body shots. And uh, then we got um, boxing drills also for legs, and of course, grappling, uh, anti-grappling maneuvers. So um, stay tuned. In the extended version, we'll be bringing you the, um, the redo of Anatomy of a Hook Punch.